Hello, it's Nearest Cry. Welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. Last time I left off, uh, let's see. I had done a bit of witchery, but I need to get a farm going, and for that I need power. Hmm. Wait, let me, why can't I see? There we go. Is power going up or down, or is it just holding steady? Oh, oh well. Um, hmm. <coughs> I want to make a reactor. Why is that not? Oh. Yeah, here we go. Reactor casing. Me graphite, me lorium. Don't have either. Let's cook these up. That's how you get graphite bars. I think that's the best way. Graphite dust. Charcoal works as well. Graphite dust is only made from... Okay. So that is the best way. Okay, now what else was I going to do? Oh wait, no. Here, I need to look up Yolorian. I've got a decent amount of it. That's what, what's the best way to process it? I think it's a sag mill. Normally it's two. They changed it. Before it was more. And you had a small chance of getting cyanide, I think it was. Or plutonium. Okay, recipes. QED, I could use coal to get three. Now we're just gonna use a sake mill. There we go. We're going to need a few bars of this. What the? How did... How does that make sense? Ah, oh, okay. Come on. Done there. Actually, Lorian can go back into my system. Now let's look up a reactor again. Let's see if I can get a stack of this stuff. Oh, I don't have a place for it yet. This is going to take up a lot of room, too. Hmm. My magic stuff sort of over here, but all my magic areas are done. Huh. What to do? Yeah, I guess you will put it over there. One sec, gonna cut out, and I'll be right back after I've built an area for it. Okay, I was uh, I was, wasn't sure I was do it, gonna do this. I was thinking of putting it on top. I think I'll actually have the bottom layer built into this. Yeah, that'll look nice. Yeah, I know exactly how this is going to be. Okay, and let's see, one... It's only going to have two in the middle, yeah. Okay. This is going to be the size I start off with. 7 by uh, 7 by 4. There are the external dimensions. It should be a good size. 
Excellent. Now we need some glass. And a whole bunch of other parts. Like fuel. We've already fuel rods. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're gonna have four rods each too high. We're gonna need uh, reactor control rods. These top at them off at the very top. One, two. Let's make like thirty-two of those. Three, four. Okay. What else do I need for the reactor? Reactor power tap? No, normally you would, but not for the one we're going for. Reactor controller? Yes, we will need one of those. Reactor access port? Two of these. Yes. The Howie something. Okay. Reactor coolant port. We're going to need two of these as well. More buckets. Two more pistons. There you go. Two reactor coolant ports. No, don't need that. Don't need that. Reactor glass. We're going to need a whole bunch of this. over here and add it a few of these things at least make the front of it okay we're going to have the I like it reactor controller there reactor coolant ports here here and I can have this here and there no reason for that that's just the way I like it glass. Okay, that side's done. I should probably do the bottom next. Especially since without the bottom I can't put the, the fuel rods inside of this. Okay, let's see how that stone's doing. Should make a lot easier. Reactor. Probably the. Yeah. Oh, graphite is what I need. I'm an idiot. I don't know why I thought that was stone. Oh, well, might as well let this finish cooking up the stone just in case I do ever need it for anything. Come on, you can do it. there. There we go. Graphite. glass we need. Actually, maybe I'll just make the bottom out of uh, regular reactor casing. Yeah, that's a good idea. Why is that not? Because it wasn't actually there. Glass, graphite, reactor, There we 
go. Go back here. Get rid of this glass. Go there, 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 and there. These actually emit light, I don't know why, but they do. Now the control rods on top. There we go. Now to get the rest of this turned into glass and fill in the rest of the area. <coughs> Let's try this amount. Sixty-two. That should definitely be enough. I th well, oh, now that I've said definitely, it definitely won't be enough. I could have actually just, you know, worked out the math, but sometimes I'm just too lazy. Now to fill this in, we're going to need uh, a lot of ingots of, uh, or a lot of resident ender. How many ender pearls do I have? Thank god I got a bl bunch. Alright, tank. Do I have a tank somewhere? This one is still, yeah, still full. Okay, where is that? What's that? Robot tank, cool. We'll start off with one of these. And upgrade it to one of these. And this one shouldn't be too bad. 128 buckets, that's way more than enough. Okay, Magma Crucible. Oops, which way are you opening? There we go. Now putting in here, and you should be... I have buckets. Why do I have buckets? I do not know. I should be able to fill two buckets at a time. This is going to take a while. Uh, I'm thinking about this. This is probably actually... Ah, that pat on the drain. Is that still on down there? Okay, it's off. As well. Now that should fix the problem, I hope. Although, I probably saw as an internal storage to fill or something like that. Who knows? Hopefully, this will pick up soon enough. I'm going to do this off camera so you don't have to watch me just uh, wait for that machine to just process all that. 
but I'm basically going to be filling this area with liquid ender, resin ender, whatever it is. I'm just going to fill up this entire thing, first the bottom layer and then a second layer. So I'll cut right back in a sec when I'm done. Ting. Okay, I'm just about finished. I have a little. I had to take a bit out because I forgot to add the endurium blocks there. In between these, it increases the efficiency. And okay, those are the reactor coolant port. Good. That's in and out. In and out. Good. You will auto outlet mode auto eject waste. And now we can put the fuel in. There we go. Because I have the coolant ports, then I have to have uh, water in this. And I have to click this mode to turn it on. Hmm. But to do that, we're going to need a turbine. We're skipping to the big one. Normally you just have one of those by itself, but nope. We want a turbine to increase efficiency. This is going to be a long project. Oh, I can't because I need cyanide. I forgot about that. Oh, and I had to use a creative cell because apparently they changed it so now these don't gain power anymore from industrial craft because I updated to 103. That's one reason why I want to get this going. I mean, I could have used one of my other power sources, but I just felt like being a bit cheap. <laughs> and just because I was a little bit annoyed that they would do that. I mean, it was working fine before. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. There you go. Now that's not there. Oh, well now we need a power tap. Yeah, I needed that for all the endurium I made. Reactor. Because I'm probably going to need that. Power tap. There we go. Yeah, this is really annoying. There we go. That's where the power will come out of. Now we need a tesseract. First we need tesseract frames, which needs more endurium, of course. Take a stack of this. I'll just grab four of those. Tin. Tin. No. Eight tin. Silver. One, two, three, four. Yes, that's it. Chuck this in here first. Oh, that was a lot. Chuck the tin in next. Chuck you in there. And the bucket's there. Ah, uh, good, you're done that. Not that it would take that long with an octatic capacitor in there. Okay, so clear that. Tin. Silver. Shiny. Grab the buckets. There you go, that's eight, which is actually enough. Just chuck these in here though. You ran out of power? Nope, still going slowly. Okay. One, two, oops. There we go, four of those. And have this going. It annoys me why they would disable that. What is taking up all this? 
but also be a good question. It's, it should be building up, because I turned this machine down here off. Or maybe this is still building up power. Let's find out. Oh wait, no. That would cut off power to those machines. To cut off power to everything, I need to break this one. Okay, let's see what that does. Yeah, it was definitely... Wait. It's still going down a bit, but definitely going up a lot faster now. Let's check that right there. I have to see what updates they made, but that's an annoying one. I'm at 1.03. Eight of those, excellent. Now we need Tesseract frames. Two of them. Actually. Use. How do I, how many, okay. Yeah, I do need that many. Why aren't you working? Yeah, empty mode, okay. Yeah, we're gonna need to give this thing a little boost of power. Don't worry, I'm, I'm only using this to supplement the fact that, like I said, it went weird on me. All my power systems no longer work that I have to add in place. should be fine. There we go. Oh, take that out. Ah, put both of those. Now, finish Tesseract. Need more bronze. Wait, isn't this a... Can I just make bronze? Or is it this one? No. Did it remove that recipe, too? 4276460. Let's see if it was 4607. Four two seven six. No. Four 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 seven three. Ah, here we go. Give me a stack. There we go. Sending, no. None. Sending only energy. There we go. I was hoping I could do what I actually wanted, but no. I guess not today. I'll just put that there for now. Power, yes. Receiving energy. That should be input, this should be output. But I don't have any conduit. Unless this will work. Max output 640. 640 is pretty good, but let's try going for these. I just need energetic alloy, which is redstone, gold, glowstone. Maybe I'll just go for the highest. Energetic, yeah. Redstone, gold, glowstone. There we go. Gold. Actually, I only need six. Wait, do we 
you can have the machine. Signal, alloy smelter. Yes. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Like, look how many pearls all this took up. Actually, where did that creative cell go? I chucked it up, didn't I? Yeah, must have. Oh, yeah, yeah, put it in here. There we go. Bam. And I should have some binder. I mean, why not make the most powerful one? This wasn't quite what I had in mind, but oh well. Let's see. This machine is currently has that much power. It should be connecting, I think. Yeah, it looks like it is. And let's flip it on, see what happens. Activate. It's building up power. Why is the power not going out? Blue was accept, wasn't it? Or was that orange? Frequency, receiving, energy, yes. Should be being sent to that. Why are you not working? Maybe it needs an uh, intermittent thing? There we go. You're full up. Maybe this will work now. No. Oh, yeah, it is working. Excellent. And all the power is being sent out. Nice, nice. I need something better than a leadstone energy cell, that's why. But I'm out of time, so I'm going to have to save that for next episode, where we're probably going to make a resonant energy cell. Yeah, this is nearly filled up. But that's at least something. So in that episode here, if you like, like and subscribe. If you don't, don't, but hope to see you next episode where there will be a lot less cheating. But luckily that will probably be because we won't have to because of an update. So hope to see you then. Take care.